Legend of Total War here with part 24 of my Call of Warhammer beginning of the end times let's play campaign as Reikland. Alright, so previously, what did we do? I think I took Hergig and something else. Okay, we've been putting this off for long enough. It's time to sally out here. We've got to get rid of these guys. Okay, it's mostly just garbage. But the thing is, we need to not lose our entire army. Like, wiping them out. Like, it would be okay if we did. As long as we won. But then, you know, we gotta get to uh, Castle Drakenhof. Because these, these vampire accounts, man, they just keep recruiting so many units. We gotta cut them off. Like, like I've said previously, don't attack the worker bee. Fucking kill the queen. Um, I, I, there's a possibility that they might attack us. Like, they might might move forward. Possibility. I've seen them do it before. As they're not like this particular army. I've seen it happen before where I sally out thinking, Oh yeah, I'm just going to annoy the fuck out of them. And then they sally out. And they're not sally out. They uh, actually make the attack. Okay, I want you two to go around the side. Because they don't have any missile units. So you can pick off, I guess, any good quality targets. I'm going to put these guys on the walls here. They can have a, a bit of a shoot. And we'll just play this by ear. So what are they doing? I think they dropped their equipment. Alright, cool. We might be able to get a few shots off before they, they get far enough back out of the, uh, the mortar range. Alright, first things first. Let's get these gunners out. see what that, what that does. Got a few of them. So we'll gradually get our troops out of the uh, town square, out of the, the city. You can bomb that. I don't, don't know what they're doing, they're just stuffing around here. Nice. Well, they only really hit a zombie division, but that's okay. Okay, looks like they're coming over here to chase after our guys here, which which can work for us, because that brings, us, uh, brings them closer to the uh, to the wall. Nope, they're, uh, they don't want to do that. Or maybe they do, I don't know. Right in there, bomb it. Don't worry, they're not going to get us. Nice shot. God, I love those mortars. The beginning of the battle is the best time to use them as well because that's when they're the most concentrated. These guys trying to hit like a small target, it's very hard for them. Hitting a big blob all over the place, that's what they're for. Alright, no, don't worry about that. Now we need to get them... Okay, let's just use the, the pistolers and stuff first. Obviously, wasting ammunition on uh, zombies not a good idea. Which is why I put them off fire wheel. We've only got a limited amount of ammunition. Let's pick some good targets. They don't have any cavalry. There's nothing they can do to catch us. Let's be told, if we had maybe half a stack of pistolers, we could do this entire battle without taking a single casualty. So, just looking for good targets. But then again, I don't think there are any like really good targets. So, just, just shoot whatever we want. Let's, let's put it on. What are these here? Skeleton spears. Alright, yep, shoot them. If we can, try and lure them closer to the, the to the walls so the um, 
the lumpen croup fighting cocks. What? Yeah, they can uh, beat them. Come on, come on, get out of there. God, the unresponsiveness of it. It's alright. It's not a big deal. And here I said with the half stack I could have done it without taking a single casualty. Right, it doesn't look like they're even getting any kills, but I know that they are. Oh, fucking shooting zombies. Doesn't matter, just get whatever. them, you need to get further back. Otherwise, there's a the chance that we'll hit our own units. Oh, come on, where are those? Where's my artillery support there? Perfect opportunity here. Blow them to shit. I think they might be too close to the wall. So they're just... Obstructed. And now we've missed our chance. That's okay, we might be able to lure them back. Yeah, see, now it's gonna shoot. Good. That's sort of like a half hit there. Still in range? Yeah, only just. Alright, stop. So, we managed to kill 25% of them so far. That's, that's a good amount. We really want to hit into this blob right in the center there. because you on a slight hill there you can see they're, they're hitting a few missed targets there oh, you piece of crap gave you an order don't fucking fight them in melee you're not gonna win Good, 33%. That's not a, not a bad amount. Fucking hell. 
you're not on the wall, are you? If, if you want to shoot, I've got no problem with that, but get up on the wall, because otherwise... I don't see how you're going to arc your shots over there, you're not a mortar. Definitely going well. So 40% and we, we haven't even lost a single percent there. Yeah, we've lost like four men so far. But we're running very low on ammunition. That was a good hit. Oh shit, man, they can be fast sometimes. Like I said, I don't want to put them on skirmish mode because I hate skirmish mode. I think it's crap. I think skirmish mode works a lot better on the smaller unit scales. Oh, look at this idiot. Yeah, well, he deserves to die for that. One bomb them. Come on, they're not like really far away. Should oh, this shot looks like it's going to be a direct hit. Very nice. Yeah, they are just zombies, but oh well, the whole army is pretty crap. Sixty percent of them. We haven't even begun the, I guess, the real fight. Just thinning them out for the time being. All the casualties we've taken there, um, all five of them or whatever, will probably be recovered because I think I will, you know, come out with the rest of my troops and finish this off. Alright, let's do this. these guys out as well, why not? I'm just going to put them on fire really, they can shoot whatever they want. Oh, they can go back inside. Good, that's it. Just keep thinning them out. Every one of them that we kill might... Well, more like every ten of them that we kill might save one of our guys because we're way better fighters than them.
Okay, there's a slight slope here, so it might be better off if we if we come up here. Might be a little bit more accurate. Also, if they get close, we use the canister shot. That does a lot of damage. Okay, it's time to get close now. Come on, reload faster. Okay, can't risk them getting killed any more than they've already lost. Oh, you slow bastards. Come on, get out of there. Oh, fucking hell, I shot my own troops there. Well, there's still a chance they'll get recovered. Depending, of course, on how many men I actually lose in this engagement. You guys, stop. Oh, crap, I shouldn't have brought these guys out here. Hopefully they don't get stuck on something. We should be able to break them. Good. So the Empire type units will uh, disappear, I think. Kind of hope to lose like a lot of these bodyguards because the more of them that die, the higher the chance will get them back. Because that's enough to only operate two cannons now, which is not good. Oh, right, yeah, because you're idiots. Just get back. I don't like these units at all, to be honest. So did they recover? So where are we? Great cannons. Yeah, they recovered. So we still got access to three cannons. Alright, now if we were to go after Castle Drakenhof, things to consider are, we could of course fight these guys out in the field, but I reckon it would be better to, to just bomb the, the castle itself. I might just do that, I don't know our forces probably aren't quite as large as theirs, but if we position our mortars well, I mean we're going to kill a lot of them, I think, and most of them are just skeletons anyway. But I think it's important that we get rid of Castle Drakenhof because that'll really slow down whatever recruitment they've got going. Can I recruit anything here? No. Just thinking if we're going to leave someone behind, I don't want to. Don't leave them behind. I don't like the Nordland Marines. But they could be useful during this fight. They might end up killing more than 103 of those swordsmen. 
If I use their guns well. I'd leave the handgunners behind. Fight for the Empire! The enemy will pay in blood! I shall storm the stronghold! Alright, let's... Only death can halt us! Experience in war counts for more... Hmm... As for them... I guess I'll just get the pistoliers to handle them. The enemy will pay with their no. blood. I feel the spirit of Okay, so what if we did this? Well, that cuts them out, but... I'd rather just get rid of them. I think I can handle this. I mean, the odds are a little bit against us, but I think we can handle it. Because like I said, most of the soldiers are just skeleton garbage. And our mortars will... If, if we're lucky, we'll kill a third of their forces. Now, I'd be willing to essentially throw away my entire army if it got us victory here, because if we, if we do get victory here, then that's going to really limit the amount of vampire count recruitment that they can get. Okay, this kind of castle, we've, we've done this before, if we, if we put them here, we can bomb over this wall right into their town square. Okay, yeah, I just need you to open up the walls there. The enemy reinforcements is going to come from right behind us. Cavalry will be good against that as well. And as for these guys, we'll um, we'll make do as we go along. Uh, they haven't put all their forces here, so we'll just be patient and we'll wait. Well, they're bringing their their guys back though. Okay, so yeah, they're coming from over here. Let's get the pistoliers to go shoot them, because the thing is, we're not going to be able to use them very well inside the castle, so might as well use them outside. So far, I've noticed that they don't really get a whole lot of friendly fire. I would have thought they'd get tons of it, but no, they're, they're pretty good with this. Yeah, definitely use the uh, the cavalry to take out the zombies, because zombies essentially count for nothing. Don't start shooting. Alright. Yeah, both of you focus on him now, because I'm going to charge into this guy. I don't want any friendly fire. Doesn't matter if they use up all their ammo, because they're not going to get another chance to use them. If you just want to come over here and just thin them out just a little bit. Alright, good. There you go, now you finish them off. Good, now we actually lost someone. Alright, good, that's done. Pretty happy with those results. 15% of their army's dead so far. Alright, look at this. There's a few guys over there, but this is what we want to bomb into right here. Right in the middle there. 
Right, four four percent of their army just on that one volley there. Come on, you're missing all over the place. You gotta get that right there, that center. I mean, I know most of them are just garbage, but there's so much garbage that you know we gotta get rid of them. Oh, fuck! Look at that bounce of power shift. Ten percent from that volley. Huge crater of casualties. If you can hit those those grave guard, that's also good. These mortars are really paying for themselves right now. Come on, right in there. Only used up half of our ammo so far as well. This is why it's good to attack a settlement that's got a full stack in there sometimes, but if you've got mortars, the amount of kills you get with them. There's no benefit for them to sit here in the town square either because they've got invincible morale anyway. But I don't think the AI fully understands that. Okay, stop. Because most of the forces in this area are dead now. Like, it's just... Fuck, it's so many of them. We want to try and hit, I guess, this section. There's still, there's a lot of them there. Looks like two or three battalions. I mean, it, it is garbage. I mean, it would be best to hit them. Just the chances of us successfully landing a hit would, would be pretty low. Okay, I think I think the chance of us actually hitting them is is uh, even lower. So let's let's actually try and hit these. Alright, because these towers here were in the way. Not a big deal. They've definitely done their worth so far. They've exceeded my expectations. Probably only got one shot left. Alright. Now then, let's get up nice and close and just destroy the gate. Because they still might be able to use these guys with their canister shot up close. If we can push them all the way back to the, the town square. Alright, gate's open. That way we're not doing any damage to the castle. We don't have to repair it. Okay, now they've got guys coming in. Let's try and occupy this section here. If you guys can come up here and get up on the high ground, that'd be good, so we can shoot them. Quickly get up here. Fuck, 
fuck you doing? Get up here. Alright, so we've already killed 57% of them. With essentially zero casualties. Let's see what else we can do. Good. Slaughtering them. Just bear with us in regard to the bird noises. I don't have a fucking pet bird, it's just birds are outside. You can hear them through the fucking window as well. The window's fucking closed. They just sit there. In many ways, the vampire accounts are very easy to deal with. Because they're just so stupid. Give it a shot shooting them from that distance. Oh, that's. I know that. Jeez, you guys are really good. Now we're we gonna lure these other guys over here. So, looking at this, 66% of them dead now. Alright, so that's the Von Karstein bodyguard. They would also be very good to shoot. If we get over there, we can get a good angle on them, but they'll just come straight for us, possibly. I don't think it's possible to get up on this wall. Not possible to climb over that bit of bit of snow. All right, let's try something else. How about you come over here? Because I don't know what's what's going on with these guys. They just AI is set to off, um, and we're just trying to shoot them. If we can lure them over here, great. And also, I've already said I don't care about these guys, so they are fairly short range. Now they're just going to sit there and take it like a bitch. Fine by me. Yeah, they don't really get a lot of kills. Maybe try to get a little bit closer. Do they do armor piercing damage? No, they don't. Even though they're ranked as firearms. I mean, they got a few kills, but that wasn't wasn't really very good. So yeah, I was right to not like these guys very much. Okay, you come over here. Yeah, they, I don't know what's going on with these guys. They're just their AI is just set to off. That does way more damage than, than the guns, even though, of course, there's more of them. Oh, hang on, here they come. Oh, you, you can beat them. Good job. Got a little bit of movement out of them. It'd be good if we can get them to chase us all the way back here. This is a bit risky. They're not going to have a good angle on this, I'll have to shoot at an awkward angle. I don't think Von Karstein Bodyguard has a lot... Yeah, they don't have much armor, so they're very vulnerable to getting shot. Okay, this is good. We want them to come at us. <laughs> this is silly. So if we can get them to here, then the other guy can shoot them, and he'll do way more damage. Good, we can get them from there.
Good Jesus Christ. I can't believe that guy's fucking dead. That's the only fighter they had that was any good. Oh, I mean, apart from the Grave Guard. I mean, we could just send them all into melee now. We'd be fine. I got, they've, they've brought some more skeleton spears up here. That's okay. Let's just do it again. Lure them down here. I mean, my archers and everything have already done their worth. Good, another one bites the dust. Bites the snow, whatever. They're out of here. We haven't lost any men yet. Okay, cool. Alright, now. Let's get all my guys up to here. Oh, right, they're on this fucking formation again. Get them all up to here. And bring the cannon up. And you two. Come around the back here. To there. Yeah, we probably could just, you know, send these guys into melee and then finish them all off. But, we'd take a lot of casualties. If, if we could thin them out a little bit more, that would obviously be preferable. Alright. If you could organize yourself over here, that would be great. No, here they come. Um, get into this formation. It's okay, looks like you're kicking their ass. Get rid of my cannons. Now, the thing is with cannons, I have to actually get them in front of my guys here. No, no, you guys need to hold your positions. Don't, don't chase them. Get to it. Better if we could shoot those grave guard, but really just any kills is better than nothing. Putting the cannons here, I don't think that'll work. Grave guard. Oh shit, you're out of ammo. Okay, your turn. So how are we going now? 81% of them, but you know, now we're starting to take some casualties. That's all my guys gone. I mean, all my archers. Ammo gone. Alright, I guess the tough part here, taking on these grave guard. I mean, I guess we can give the cannons a shot from over here. No harm in just giving it a shot. I think they're better on the attack than in stupid bloody spear wall formations. Get over here. Yeah. 
All right. We're in position, I guess. Let's get the canister shot on. I'm not sure if we can actually do any damage to them from here. I guess we'll find out. Looks like only one of the cannons is actually going to operate. Yeah, we definitely got some of them. I just need to put them on fire at will. I'm reluctant to use my cavalry because this is a... I can't really control them properly from here. There's always a high chance of actually getting a general killed. Those Grave Guard are really holding up for a while. I don't even know where they're shooting. Okay, just try a standard shot. Maybe try hit over there. That's no, not working. Oh, that worked. Attack. Oh, good, that's working. Good. Okay, there's only a handful of uh, Grave Guard left. We should be able to mop up the rest of these quite easily. Now let's use the canister shot again. Come on. Definitely hitting them, but I, I could be hitting my own units as well, so let's, let's not do that. This is explosive rounds. Melee infantry are fucking dead. But still, it's totally worth it. Given the victory that we're, we're doing here. No, enough of that. Hey, what the fuck happened? One of them died. Idiots to shot your own men. They should still be able to operate three cannons, though. With 11 men. Alright, let's send in the cavalry. Maybe... Alright, I'm fire at will. Stop that. It would have sucked so hard if um, one of our generals died. Considering this is just the last little bit of the battle. Trying to avoid those grave guards. Good. I think that really could have gone much better. How the hell did we manage to capture a zombie? Because they don't break. Praise Sigma! Victory is yours! Praise Sigma! Alright, cool. Victory is yours! 
So he's a, considered a legendary commander now. So that's great. Uh, these guys here, are they likely to... No, they, they're not going to take Templehof next turn, so we'll be able... Do we still have movement? No. Oh, Waldenhof, bad. Trouble got it? No, it's fine. And at Drakenhof, no, we can't recruit anything here. But that's okay. The vampire accounts. I reckon next time, if we have a look at their uh, faction rating, it'll plummet. They've lost their core territories. They've lost Sylvania. Forty-six minutes into it, the video. So I might end this soon. Soon everything will come to pass as I desire. Well, I got twenty-eight thousand to spend, which we spend it on. Yeah, some more troops out here could be a good thing, because they they took Lyonnais recently. Um, if they come up here, we'd want to be able to repel them. So we need troops for that. Also, it might be a good idea to continue constructing stuff, because we do need more money. More money means more troops. So, should we get the merchant? So, the merchant bank provides 600. That provides an additional 100. But it's, that's 10 times as expensive. So, we'll go with that. This what printing house? Yeah, no. it's a pretty hefty bonus right there. The uh, merchant bank. If we have a look here, does there is there another merchant bank or is it just the one thing off? So banks, we've got the merchant bank and then the merchant vaults. It's plus nine hundred. So much money. Which, you know, you need. Okay, so in Wissenberg, which is just a large town, when does it become a minor city? Fairly soon. If I was to build this, that would give us 300, which is crap. Brothel, Alchemist Lab, Crop Rotation. That only increases tradable goods, not actual farming. Anyway, it's not like the public order is not growing fast enough. I might actually just drop the taxes a bit. No fucking, I need the money. Some of the good troops require a blacksmith, so... Let's see. I don't have to build anything here. But I'll get the blacksmith. Thing we also used to build. If I build this, it doesn't do anything. That doesn't do anything. Yeah, that's pretty good. Some extra law and um, public health that'll help grow the population. Might be able to increase the tax rate soon. Okay, I got a little bit of cash left over. Okay, and we'll end the episode here, guys, so like and subscribe, part 24 is next, and don't forget to visit me on Facebook. See you next time, fuckers.